Welcome back to Wasteland 2. Let's continue to explore Hotel California. Something kind of strange happened when I loaded my game, though. These salt junkies, which I'm pretty sure were not actually in this room, they just appeared and they're just standing right at the doorways. So there's two right here and then there's one over here. I have no idea what's up with that. Seems to be some sort of a bug. Can I talk to them? Nope. Alright, so this is where I think they're probably buying the salt, and oh, okay, it's not. <laughs> this is just the front door? Is this the front door? Or is that the front door? Oh, I can't even go back in this way. That's weird. Okay. Well, I guess into the sewers we go. This place looks toxic wasty. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Probably more where that came from. Or maybe there isn't. Mmm, salt thugs. Yep, I think this is where they produce it. Or at least where the uh, crazed salt people live. Let me guess. These are trapped. Hmm, they actually aren't. That's surprising. What does Priest's Skullcap look like? Looks like a skull cap. No thanks. Oh, I'm glad I uh, stopped him from moving. He was moving without the rest of the party, which means he would have walked right into this. Explosive would be perfect for that group. <laughs> Look at them all waiting for that massive mutated rat to finish cooking. Mmm. Which way do I go first? No idea. Let's pick a direction and go. I guess let's go here.
Let's see, how much armor do they have? Six, five, five, seven. Okay, so this weapon would be good only against the heavy gunner, and he's out of range, so not gonna happen. Yeah, enjoy my shotgun. Hi. Damn, two of them missed. Up close and personal. I can do that. Oh yeah, the death ray. Let's see, what is it, two times damage? Two point four times. So assume I get a low roll at fifty, two times would be a hundred, so it's probably gonna do about a hundred and twenty to hundred and fifty damage. It's pretty damn good. I'm not gonna go for that this turn though. Probably take out that heavy gunner. <laughs> Thankfully, he did not shoot this turn, which is good because with that minigun, he could tear into the entire group. Be pretty damn nasty. Almost got him. No, please, please don't go forwards. He's very fragile compared to us. Just stay in the back. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and kill you. Kill you. I kind of don't want to waste a burst, but there is a chance this won't kill him. I'd have to roll really, really low, though. I'd have to roll either a 57, a 58, or a 59 to not kill him. It's gonna kill him. <laughs> yep, that was a crit, I think. It's not even worth using the energy weapon on those people. They're probably not going to come closer, though, because they have ranged weapons. So... Guess I'll just get closer and take cover. really do a considerable amount of damage. have to process that down. Way too heavy. In fact, I think I'm probably just going to process all of it. Well, no, I'm actually not even close to being burdened. I guess I might as well keep it and sell it. How much money do I have? 
10,000. Not bad. Yeah, I'm going to keep it. I'm not going to keep this thing, though. This thing's way too heavy. Human flesh. I'm just gonna leave that there. Whoops. I didn't mean to take it. Let the rats have it. Hmm. See if I can break this down with Yulia's wonderful shotgun. Okay, they're all trapped. Uh, I should probably just leave this on. This is teamwork. One D demolitions, the other takes out the lock.
I feel like this entire level, this whole sewer level, is just like a one big skill check. It's like a test of my might. Let's see, is this looping around to where I've already been? Not sure. But, let's see what's over here first. Whoa, 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 whoa. No idea where that leads to. I mean, the surface, obviously, but we're on the surface. Whoa, shit! Oh. I need, I need to move slower. Hello, crazy uncle Villpola. And your crazy uncle Toaster. Can I help you? Crazy Uncle Vilpola. Crazy Uncle Vilpola's prices are insane! Okay, we'll bite. What are you selling? Crazy Uncle Vilpola is selling the key card to that sewer door over there and you won't believe what a bargain it is! Bargain? We can't wait for Crazy Uncle Vilpola to tell us. Crazy Uncle Vilpola is selling the car for just please help me fix this toaster. Well, it just so happens I'm bad with toasters, but do you know what I'm good with? I'm good with asses. <laughs> Looks like it's your brains that need the fixing, Pops. Crazy Uncle Vilpola says, I'm sorry, that item is temporarily out of stock. I don't think it worked. Shit, it didn't work. The price of the keycard is fixing the toaster? Alright, let's see it. <laughs> I, I like that they're trying so hard to justify the existence of the toaster repair skill. Because the toaster repair skill is a skill. They're trying so hard to justify its existence, they just make some random sewer salesman show up. And he won't sell to you unless you fix his toaster. <laughs> Gotta give them props. They're trying to make that skill not be a dump stat. But I'm sorry, it's still a dump stat. Alright, ho hold on. Does somebody actually have more than one skill in toaster repair? I don't think anybody does. It's probably a level 10 anyway. Yeah, nobody does. I believe with that, um... The kit. This thing. Yeah, plus two toaster repairs. So I can get my skill up to three, but <laughs> that's not going to be enough for anything. No. Well, sorry, Pops. This place is freaking massive. My god. Look at this place. And this tunnel here looks like the tunnel to hell. Yeah. 
Alright, just pick a direction and let's go. Let's kill these foos. And you're dead. Ah, oh, so close. I'm, of course, in a very tactically sound position with everybody bunched up and nobody crouching. Don't worry about it. God damn it, I should have headshotted. Just out of range. You know, I want to get some use out of my shotgun, so I'm going to do this. I'll let Lexcanium be a distraction. Yes, come closer to the woman wielding a shotgun. I encourage you. My distraction man is a success. I can't believe this Alex dude hasn't died yet. <laughs> oh my god. My assault rifle people are basically snipers. Uh... Well, sorry, Alex. My quest log just updated. I forgot what he, what was he even related to. Hmm. Where would it be? I guess it's still ongoing. What the hell is it? I don't know. Whatever. Uh. See if I can scare this guy out of hiding. This is where the poison comes from. This is the place that turns normals into zombies. We must destroy it. I quite agree. He just said this ain't a fight, this is a massacre. It is, but I'm not sure which way he means that. I don't know if he means that as his battle cry, like we're gonna massacre you. Or if he means that he's screwed, because he certainly is screwed. Oof. 
freaking sniping this guy in cover from across the map. Uh, we can clean him up with a shotgun. Wait a minute. You are missing something. Copy, Rick. Congratulations. Harper, three skill points. Nope. Theodore, six skill points. Yes. Let's go with Field Medic. Booze. It's about the least dangerous drug in this place. Look at the cute little fan spinning. It even oscillates. Okay, we can fix it. Again? Uh, can I fix it again? I don't think I can. Good job, Harper. Alright, so can I destroy these tanks? Looks like they cook salt in these tanks. I believe I can. Can I do it with a shotgun? Sweet! And I think I was just out of range. Let's blow the rest up, too. Hopefully it'll take out this locked chest along with it. No, don't go to it. Ooh, it did. Sweet. And let's take out the last one with style. Use my death ray. <laughs> that is freaking awesome. Oh god, I can't see the contents of the chest or the goop. I can't click it. Oh, oh, there it is. A crushed can and glass shards. Yay! Let's prepare my people a little bit more this time.
Well, perfect. Just lining themselves up for my double blast of wonderful love. Yes, please, throw yourself into my lines of fire. Zeppi. Three points, not enough for anything. Oh, wait a minute, I've been here, haven't I? Yeah, I think I just started to go down this way and then I stopped. Wait a minute. These junkies aren't red. That's strange. Do they wish to speak? Hmm. Overdose? What's going on? Let me see if I can use surgery. <laughs> Zero percent chance, Jesus. Oh, that's right, all skill checks are basically 100 per uh, level 10 at this point. So, yeah, and his, his surgery is what, level 7? Damn. I can't help you, I'm sorry. Ooh, another death ray. And that can replace Yulia's weapon. Nice. Because I'm pretty sure the Death Ray is simply better than the Ion Beamer, right? Uh, it's worth more money. Vastly more damage. Much more range. Same capacity. Armor threshold's the same. It does cost more AP. That's right, the AP. Hmm. I think it's better, though. Let's take the scope off this one. <laughs> no, don't put it back on the same item. Tactical scope? Hmm. Is that better than the high-powered scope? Plus 6 meters optimal range, as well as increasing my maximum range by 8. Oh wow, that's simply better, isn't it? High powered scope gives me plus 7 maximum range, this gives me plus 8 maximum range, plus, plus 6 optimal range. Yeah. Taking that baby off. What else does this thing support? Under barrel? Don't think I have any. Could look for one. Yeah, why not? That's a barrel, not an under barrel.
Let's see, does anybody need a high-powered scope? That has one. That has one, of course. And that has one. It's got a tactical scope, nice. That does not support scopes. Ooh, this has a small scope. I wish I could help her, but I can't. Hello, woman. <laughs> Just a random prostitute in the sewers. I'm yours for 15 scrap. Uh, yeah, I've had enough crusty clams. No thanks. It's weird that these junkies aren't interested in fighting me. Okay, I've been that way. And that... Is that where I came from? So both exits go to Hollywood. Oh wait, I think I've actually explored the entire sewers, haven't I? Oh, no I haven't. Got a false wall here. And while my people are going to that, let me see if I've missed anything else. Any other not actually dead ends? So I do want to see where this exit goes. It goes to Hollywood somewhere, but I want to know where in Hollywood. Whoa! Oh, right! There's people there. I forgot. Ow. the fuck is that? Should I be worried? That was interesting. You see a very old computer with a big ominous red button. What could possibly go wrong? It's fine. Can't use computer science on it. Can't repair it. Alright, press the button. Did you press it? Uh, did we press it? I mean, the screen shook for a second. I am getting no feedback whatsoever. I guess we pressed it. Sure. What the hell did that do? Strange. So yeah, well, my people are going to that exit to Hollywood that I want to check out. Let me see if I'm missing anything. No, I think that's it. 
All right, let's see where this goes. <laughs> Wait a minute. There's an entrance into the sewers in somebody's house. I hear sexy time happening, which means this must be Heidi's hideaway, right? Oh wait, is this Heidi's room? Ooh, maybe there's some secret documentation. Why would she have an entrance to the sewers? Does that mean she's a salt addict? It does raise some questions. Also, that is a nice ass bed. At the base of the statue, you notice curving scratches in the floor as if the statue was often moved out of the way. Tracing up the base of the statue to its arm, you notice a faint seam with grind marks circling the shoulder. That arm is a leather. Uh, a leather. That arm is a lever. She'll never know anybody was in her room. You think the massive pools of blood on the ground will give it away? Nah. Salt Lab keycard. This is Heidi's hideaway, right? It is. I don't know if this is actually her office, though. I suspect it is, though, which means I think she might be behind the salt operation. Would not surprise me. Notebook is a ledger consisting of pages of numbers, some of which look like, uh, look like weights, some look like dates, some of which look like prices. Nothing is labeled, however, so it's hard to be sure. One thing that does stick out, however, is a five-digit number scrawled on the inside front cover. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. There's no indication what the number refers to, but it looks like some sort of code. Perhaps that was to the safe? If I wasn't able to crack it, I could have used the code. Oh shit. How did the bodyguard not notice me? Just gonna close this door. Okay, let's not leave that way. This does unfortunately leave me in the position of still not knowing where the HCC is. I still need to get their votes, and I don't know where in the hell they are. I have no damn idea. So, I think I'm going to search for the HCC in the next episode. So, I hope you've enjoyed so far, and I'll be back soon.